Hello, YouTube. Did you miss me? Probably not. Are any of you even still subscribed? Well, it looks like a few of you are. Well, you're in luck, because I'm coming at you with a, no, a new video. Hopefully, this is assuming I actually find anything. Some of you may be wondering why I haven't uploaded in, oh gosh, three years now? Well, it's not because I got burnt out or bored or anything like that. I just couldn't find any herps. So, I, you know, you can't find herps, then you can't really have a YouTube herping channel, can you? But, I'm giving it a try. Uh, a bit rusty. It's been, it's been a while. I think 2019 was my last video. So, truth is, I don't find a lot of herps. At least, as far as things like snakes go, which seem to be the most popular things to herp for. But, I do find a lot of turtles. And so, Assuming you guys are interested in turtles, I could probably salvage this dying channel on turtles alone. Right now I am looking for spotted turtles. There's a shot of the habitat I'm looking in here. It's February 14th. It's a little cold out. I think it's warm enough that some of these spotted turtles will be out early basking. And this is a great time of year to look for them because in the spring and summer, this is all going to be overgrown. They're going to be almost impossible to find. Never mind all the biting flies and mosquitoes and ticks that'll be infesting this spot. So this is this is a good time. And uh, I've had luck here in the past. The last couple of years, I've been reliably finding spotted turtles in this location. So I figure it's about time to make a video about them. And uh, you know, if you like it and you want to see. If you want to see more, then let me know. I will do my best. Oh, check it out, guys. Look. First one of the year. And I knew I'd find one today. I knew it. It's a little early yet. But I had a feeling it was warm enough to bring out these turtles. Check that out. Absolutely beautiful. These are one of the few herps I can reliably find in Maryland. And I spent so many years looking for these in New York. Never saw one. So to be able to just come out here, 10 minutes away from my house, walk out in the woods, find one like this is a real treat. It kind of makes up for the lack of everything else. So my strategy in a place like this is pretty straightforward. Got a nice wide path here. I'm just walking around looking in on the banks of the water that's flowing through here. And they're pretty easy to spot because you know they got them jet black shells of shiny sitting in the sunlight and the benefit of doing this in the late winter too is that they're cold so they're not particularly fast which means i can sneak up on them well i don't even really have to sneak up on them i can just walk over and pick them up generally on my way out thinking it was going to be a one and done kind of day but there is a turtle across the water Let's see if i can line that you can't see it but it's right there have to cross the water, get my feet wet to get you this turtle, but I'm going to do it. It's bigger than the last one. Oh, that's cold. There you go. Spotted turtle number two. Now 
Not bad for the second week of February. Check this out. I'll give them a little dip. So you can see what those look underwater. Just look at that. Beautiful. Like stars in the night sky. It's now February 21st. And I'm out fishing, but I have not gotten a single bite. So instead, I'm just kind of cruising around looking for turtles in the water. The water's crystal clear, the sun's out. It's probably why I'm not catching any fish. I'm trying to paddle one handed here. It's not easy. But, um,. Lots of turtles out, and if I can catch one, I will. I can see them basking all around me, but they're fast, so if I get too close, then they slide off their basking spot and swim off. Picked up this beautiful. Eastern painted turtle. Look at that. Look at that red. It's so stunning. I was just kayaking by and it was swimming in the water and I reached down and scooped it up. I really appreciate that he's not tucking into his shell, but he's flailing about so we can get a good look at him. One of the most common turtles in North America, especially in the Northeast, I suppose. But uh, so beautiful, you can never get tired of seeing them. Well, easy there. He's scratching up my hand. We're gonna put it back. There you go, fella. Enjoy the warm weather. can't see it but I can on that stick that's that log that's sticking out in the water there there's a big red belly cooter and I am going to try to go get that guy I better put down my phone while I do it because I got a paddle in one hand and the phone in the other I'm not gonna be able to grab a turtle with my hands full I don't know if you can see him can I zoom in yeah, it's right Right over there. He was hoping. Sitting right there. When it took off in the water, you can see the bubbles and mud stirred up where he plopped in. I don't think he's moved from that spot because the water around me isn't stirred up. So I think if I paddle over there, I can just reach down in there and grab it. Let's see if I can do this one handed without tipping over the kayak. Oh, oh, yes. Look at that. I did it. Ooh. Oh, you're a beast. Heavy. Hold on here a second. I gotta reposition things. Oh, man. Look at that. She's beautiful. Heavy. There you go. You can get a good idea as to the size of her next to my ugly face. Beautiful. Well, I decided to give up on the fishing. Since I was having good luck with turtles there, I decided to come out here and look for spotted turtles again. And I'm glad I did, because there's one right there. I don't think it's going to make a swift getaway. Look at this, just sitting there on the trail. <laughs> oh man, it's so great just to be able to walk out here and find these like this. I'm not even gonna bother picking this one up because why? 
He's just sitting there minding his own business. I feel no need to disturb it. Although he's tucking in, so I guess he is disturbed. Yeah, how about that? See how easy they can be to spot in a place like this? Of course, once they slip underwater, they're dark shell with a little yellow spots, they blend right in. Hear that? Those are New Jersey chorus frogs. And here, just in these puddles, they're one of the first frogs to start singing in the spring. I don't think I'm probably gonna get to see any because they're pretty good at shutting up and hiding when people get close. I'll have to come back out here at night if I really want to, with a flashlight, if I really want to spot some. But I'll uh, eyeball around there and see what's going on. Yeah, as you can see, they've already gotten too close. And they've already clammed up. They're so small. They're about the same size as a spring peeper. You know, only like Size my thumbnail. At night is the time to look for them. Guys, check it out. There are two turtles right there. You could probably see them, but look what's in my way. <laughs> oh, one of them already took off. Oh, now goes the other one. It fell on its back. I don't think I can get to it. There it goes. I'm gonna try to at least get closer. Oh man. I don't think it's happening. But they were there, and you saw them. The real question is, do I want to go digging around in there looking for them? Uh, I don't think so. Okay, there's no one right there. That one's pretty high up on the bank. I think I can get to it before it gets to the water. in a hurry. Uh, how do I want to approach this though? Oh, so many prickers. That's a big one. I bet that's a female. I'm just going to go through the water. Hopefully not drop my phone. Oh man. Oh, that's cold. worth it look at that look at that cluster of spots right there it's a little smiley face this is one that if i find in the future i'll definitely remember let's see if it's easily alive oh yeah beautiful i don't think it's a she though I'm not too good at telling apart the sexes with these but that plaster is kind of concave so Hello, beautiful. Thank you for coming out to see me. Don't usually get to see their faces. Made crossing this water worth it. All right, take a couple pictures and put her right back where I found her. There you go, beautiful. Right back where I found you. Out for raccoons. On my way out, and looks like I got one last turtle. Look at that. Beautiful. They do look best when they're wet like that, don't they? 
as you can see, when they're in the water like that, the dark tan and stained waters, the reflection through the, through the trees, they almost disappear. got to be kidding me. Look at this. Look at this. Haven't we all learned what these things can do to the environment? Haven't we all seen the pictures? Unbelievable. That people still leave these lying around. It's unbelievable that they still exist, to be honest with you. I could just see one of my beautiful little spotted turtles getting stuck in this thing. Oh, God. I hate people. I really do. Obviously, I'm taking this with me.